Have a good day, everybody. Currently in our area, 65 degrees under mostly cloudy skies. Today, areas of patchy fog early. Thunderstorms developing in the afternoon. High, 82. Tonight, scattered thunderstorms during the evening. Partly cloudy skies after midnight. Low, 59. Chance of rain, 50%. Here's our seven-day outlook. Good Monday morning to you. It is September 1st. It is also Labor Day. We're working, so if you're working, you're not alone. We even made Carl Parker come in and work for Mike <laughs> Bettis this morning. We're about to forecast everything about this Monday, whether you're on holiday or getting up and getting ready and headed to work. Massive storms, supercells like this one, and lightning strikes, a crowded beach. Look for stormy skies today. We've got your forecast, and we're tracking these storms and how they will affect your Labor Day plans. Maria? In New York, subway stations flooded, streets flooded, and beachgoers struck by lightning. Storms hit New York and New Jersey on Sunday, and we're not in the clear yet. And a system is trying to develop off the Gulf of Mexico. I'll break down the odds of it turning into a tropical storm oh, wow. and whether it will send rain up the Gulf Coast. Oh. Protesters in Ferguson, Missouri, don't want this to be a happy holiday. Why they're planning to shut down Interstate 70 and other St. Louis highways. That's in your headlines. And it may be a holiday, but we're still getting amazing weather video this morning out of Canada. Huge hail, Canada, Kansas, huge hail falling from the sky, 2.5 inches in circumference. That's the size of a tennis ball. The storm also dumped an estimated three inches of rain. This thing just would not quit. You can see it there in the car. You can hear it bouncing off the car. Yeah, that's a tough place to be, making visibility difficult. Where do you pull over? The skies are completely open right there, Maria. Uh, just unbelievable. Unfortunately, caught some people outside in it. New York, severe storms interrupted those holiday plans. Three men struck by lightning at the beach Sunday evening. Thunderstorms also caused flight delays. That's never a good thing on a busy holiday weekend. And they even had to stop the U.S. Open until those storms passed. You don't want to talk about a lot of people out in it. Yeah, everybody was out in it. As a matter of fact, in the interviews after that lightning hit, you, the guys were saying it looked like it hit the water it hit or hit the beach. And they heard this huge explosion right in front of them. All right, let's get you started with the big event this Labor Day. Yeah, there are plenty of storms to keep you going around. So dodging them in and out, 